the Storm Team Weather Lab. KMAC meteorologist Kellyanne Class. Yeah, the calendar may say the end of September, or at least nearing the end of September, but Mother Nature is saying it's still about mid-July. Still expecting temperatures to be well above average for this time of year into the upper 80s and even lower 90s. Good news, not expecting, of course, those triple digits, but still not going to be expecting any fall-like weather anytime soon. Also could be expecting maybe a few more rain chances on the way, but before we get to that, we do have to get through some hot and dry conditions, and we'll see that today and even tomorrow, and even this morning outside right now now in post waking up to clear conditions. Not really any clouds across the area to start off your morning. Bigger story is going to be the temperatures. Currently 66 degrees in post at the moment. 65 degrees here in the Hub City. 61 in both Anton and the Level Land to start off. So some of you may need a light sweater as you step out the door this morning. Otherwise you won't need it because it's still going to feel uh, pretty mild outside. Still going to keep that summer like warmth around over the next several days and in fact well above average for this time of year. High temperatures will be about 7 degrees above average over the next couple of days. And even though we'll be watching a cold front that will move on through about Thursday, still going to be expecting well above average temperatures and maybe a little bit more of an increase in chance of rainfall over the next couple of days. Otherwise, very minimal rain chances. And if you're looking for fall, unfortunately not looking like it will be within not only the next seven days or even the next six to ten. The Climate Prediction Center still has us at about a 70% chance of above average temperatures. So still likely we will see those upper 80s and lower 90s stick with us over the next uh, about 10 days or so. So unfortunately, Fall not coming anytime soon, but we do know when it will come here, it will come very quickly thanks to some pretty strong cold fronts that typically move through about October and even November. But for now, though, pretty much sunny, dry, and hot is going to be over the next couple of days, and even starting off this morning very dry. A few clouds along the state line, otherwise pretty much clear conditions. Keeping those clear conditions throughout the day today with temperatures hovering into the upper 80s and even lower 90s. Unfortunately, no rain today, but it looks like the climate, excuse me, the Storm Prediction Center does have about an isolated chance for a few showers, especially along the state line. I do think most of us will stay dry today, so rain chances will be minimal today and even tomorrow. But the better chance for rain really does come about Thursday and Friday at about 10 percent. And then even a better chance on Saturday at about 22, even potentially 30 percent, but still going to be well above average in terms of temperatures for this time of year. Looks like we may keep those uh, above average precipitation chances over the next six to 10 days as well. Not a very strong signal, but a little bit better signal than that drying trend on the way. So something to keep in mind and something to look out for. But for today, got to get through those dry and hot conditions. High temperature today of 90 degrees. Most Mostly sunny, maybe a spot shower or two off in eastern New Mexico that will drift along the state line. Other than that, very dry and sunny. Tonight we'll keep those clear conditions. Temperatures falling down into the mid to upper 60s. We're keeping the above average low temperatures and above average high temperatures over the next several days. 91 tomorrow, 88 by Thursday. That's all thanks to a weak cold front that's going to move through, but still will feel hot and still above average, keeping the rain chances until about Saturday. But this weekend actually looking fantastic. 86 both Saturday and and Sunday, so mid 80s, but we look like we will warm up back into those upper 80s by next week. Yeah, definitely not looking for a warm up. We're just going to be waiting for that cool down that sticks around. I think we're all just hoping for that. Yeah, you need to keep on doing your little, you know how we have like rain dances and stuff? We need a fall dance. You need to come up with a fall dance. Kelly is always trying to I'm get me still to waiting dance. for her to dance. Dance on air. She's going to do it one day, I promise, guys. We'll see about that.